Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim. Welcome to World Class Discussions for Overseas Pakistanis, wherever you are in the world. Hope you're having a wonderful, blessed day. I have some questions for you. How many of you love traveling? And how many of you worry a little bit about your salah when you are traveling? And how many of you travel but are not aware of the rules? So rule number one is consult a scholar. But let me tell you, if you are traveling for more than 48 miles and you intend to stay somewhere for less than 15 days, then you are allowed to read the Salah of a Musafir, often known as Qasr, where you can reduce the amount of Faraiz that you are reading, except from Maghrib to two Rakats only. So consult a scholar on that. Now, yesterday we travelled from Bradford about 210 miles for a Janazah Salah. So another question, how many of you do not know how to read a Janazah Salah? So rule number one, please consult a scholar and learn it. But let me just tell you a very, or oh, shall I share with you uh, my very brief uh, knowledge on it as well? Because it's extremely important. It's far as it could be fire. Now, what should you do and how should you read it? Well, one, you're often reading with uh, uh, an imam. So when the, the imam says, Allahu Akbar, you raise your hands and you read thana. After the second takbir, without raising your hands, you read the Rud Ibrahim. After the third rakat, you raise your hands and you read the dua of a janaz of the janaza, depending on if it's a boy or a girl after the fourth takbir without raising your hands you complete this salah and you turn to each side and read salam so please go and learn it so on our journey yesterday i share with you when we're leaving bradford it's roughly about 210 miles uh, we faced all sorts of challenges and eventually ended up at the ilford community center so please remember remember to subscribe like and share uh, the video as well and just enjoy the journey with us inshallah so keep watching and hope you're having a wonderful blessed day today is a day of travel and did you know that it, it is encouraged to travel very far okay in order to seek knowledge and in order to seek those things that are good the prophet sallallahu alaihi wasallam recommended that we travel in groups okay groups of two and three to reduce negative influences upon us as well so today we have set off on a journey of roughly about 210 miles it's been raining and it's been very dry it's been congested on the motorway there's been lower speed limits as well however this is a day-to-day -day part of life and each and every day with prayer with charity and with alms giving, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala helps us through our daily lives. And Islamically, it is said, said generally actually, is that a man, a person is known by his intentions. So our intention today is to travel for the sake of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, to make dua through our journey. They say the dua of a musafir is also accepted and to take part uh, in the janazah prayer and make prayers for the deceased that Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala increases their levels in paradise Amen. and for all my friends and families those say Pakistan ke no rakhbal mulkunu ki guri no filal chede na munga hide break lo honi oko Hamida sister, Okasha, Amir and family as well agar aap dekh rahe bhai aapko bot bot salam abhi safar ka second part shuru hone wala hai और यहाँ देखो बिजली के साथ गाड़ी चार्ज हो रही है या शायद चार्ज हो रहा है गाड़ी लक्या चार्ज की की संगति टेलीफोन चार्ज की की आ माशाल्लाह जब मुझे रात का टक्कर लगा ही दे वाला आर्ड सो इट्स टाइम टू गो इन्शाल्लाह सो आई दे उगरा दल तने चिदन हो लक्या उसो तने चिदन हो जब मुझे मोटरवे सर्विस स्� London, Leicester, Birmingham, Tarafta, Ramanu. You round about now. Saji side, Nadir, Sari, Gadi, Ramanu. So, they have to go where to go. 
Beach is safe. זה מילה שלו בעזו, אחר לצ'אנס בלאשו. זה אנחנו ספסטי סייט, אנחנו קטקים. ראונד אנד ראונד אנד ראונד אנד ראונד. סו, פטניסט פופטו, כי שמאל קום טרפטה, יהיה ג'נוב קום טרפטה, יהיה חוזר מה חל למורה. ג'נוב טרפטה ראני, which is south. דו עשי דקה, נכון? דאדי, דה M1. M1 motor rage there in London Lazi and there is a sign that there is a sign that 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 is a sign So we are back on the motorway so the motorway is a sign that is a sign that is a sign that is a 50 mile an hour speed limit so since setting off from Bradford Bradford is there it is in West Yorkshire so we've gone through West Yorkshire which includes Bradford, Leeds, Huddersfield, Halifax and little bits of Wakefield. Then we've travelled to South Yorkshire, which includes Barnsley, Huddersfield and Rotherham. Further down into Derbyshire, which obviously includes like Derby, Matlock and quite a few other places too. Further down we've gone into Nottinghamshire through Robin Hood country. Then we've hit further counties, um, uh, not, uh, sorry, uh, Northamptonshire which is Northampton and then Shire <laughs> and further further on now we're in Buckinghamshire and I believe we're heading towards Bedfordshire and Luton so there's been fair amount of delays 50 mile an hour speed limit there or Baranu Tersho, Nwaru Tersho, Tiaru Tersho, Ranaung Rala all sorts of weathers or your topaki brakes who are in our Maki Ugari M180 signs these so Dunstable and Luton or Tamila Patidi our London touch is 38 miles remaining. So just be with us as we continue on the journey, inshallah. And remember to subscribe, like, and share as we have another order for 50 miles per hour. So it's break number two, twin break, Laralu. Oh, today's day, welcome a break. On in Saturday day, so I don't get a coach on our day, Halak Chidan or for Bal Mech Lel Kiabuzi. It's a very busy day. Car park duck day or Shezad Chidan or bathroom Lel Telene. Aba Hardasi Yachta Chichichichichi. Ah, Shala Gadi Ki Dunna Chidan. Oh, it's lovely, nice and warm. Adachi made the Anko, the seat Papa Yeshe Dushi. Get very warm, that he did the seat. And we're just waiting to go. So as we continue to travel, Akbul Safar Bani Rawaniu, Oshidan Motor Ray Bani Havde Jamsho. So Mukhi Abakari Al Abadi Hifazat Satisa accident. Kashiri, no traffic roro Rawan de no Safar ki Khudasi zuna Ragali di in these sort of journeys. You know, a journey sometimes is described as a fire because it brings so many. Uh, challenges of, of every sort you know um, your food is affected your sleep is affected your journey is affected your mood is affected as as well your attitude is is, is affected as well you know there's a famous coco melon little song that says are we there yet are we there yet <laughs> and the parents keep saying not yet not yet so as the journey continues on on the motorway this various trials and little tribulations that will will come up and they say that you know a man is known by the company he keeps so alhamdulillah i have good company around me we have positive conversation going on uh in the car as well so it's very calm and it's very fairly mild and uh, my sister hamida if you are watching keep watching because i know she watches all all the videos out in uh in pakistan with all the uh, uh the family as well or you can go the purpose of these videos is to bring us together okay to chat have world-class discussions about what we see even if it's a European truck or a tanker on the left so we can have positive conversations we can have unity and these things come okay when we are uh, attracted around the table so put a whole load of food around the table get the video on and enjoy inshallah and remember to subscribe a like and share with us as well inshallah or share with others should i say inshallah 
So as we carry on <laughs> being stuck in the, in, in the traffic, um, Obada, agar ab dekh rahe hai, okay, balki beta, <laughs> mashallah, Obada, Pakistan atak se bhot bhot mubarak ho, anti carry hai ki aapne khatam kiya hai. Inshallah, jab main Pakistan aunga to aapko hadiya bhi dunga, inshallah. Hamari liye bhot bhot dua karein aur Quran padte rahe, inshallah. Quran ke saath misbat rakte rahe, inshallah. Quran ke upar amal karte rahe, inshallah. Oh, hamari liye bhi dua karein ki ham bhi uske upar inshallah chale. Allah ilaha illallah, Muhammad Rasulullah, jo haq hai, sach hai. Ye asl mein asl hai. Isse aur aur koi asl nahi. So please remember us in your prayers. And keep giving dawa upon that kalima as well. That la ilaha illallah Muhammad Rasulullah comes into our life. That we have full yaqeen on Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That he is the creator, sustainer. He is the doer of everything. And the creation cannot do anything without the help of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That the day cannot become night and the night cannot become day. Without the hukum of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That we can have money in our pockets, but we cannot attain anything without the hukum of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. That we have a car that is capable of 160 miles an hour on the motorway, but we cannot get to our destination on time because the hukum of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is not there. Because everything happens with the will of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. May we make effort upon this and bring it into our lives, inshallah, and spread the word as well. As we carry on being stuck in this jam and we have sabr and patience, and on the right-hand side of the vehicle, it appears that we have a huge little uh, base as well that appears to have appeared within the last few years. Uh, Lidl is a supermarket in the UK and I'm not sure if it's a distribution or manufacturing plant or in the Khali Razda, so London taraf ta asim khalik jidhan asail as you see it's a main hub and a main city or football traffic, sports traffic, Saturday par asi hum deno kaafi busy vi so Allah madad sara jidhano ro ro rawan yu So as we travel, here's a flying authentic Indian beer, Buffalo. Kala gari dekho buzi, kala afa buzi. Wo made the skilly ho inadi ho se kala afa rawan ne, kala dekha rawan ne. So the motorway has cleared up, mashallah, and we have now zooming along at 70 miles an hour, and as you can. You can see St. Albans, the historic Roman city in this area, known as Hertfordshire. And London and St. Albans is in a straight direction. So we have about 30 or 40 miles left on our destination. And hopefully we can flow through a little bit more easier. UK, you know, 70 miles an hour, but limit the motorway money. Or traffic chidan filhal hashtara rawan de or left hand side the chilia chilia garde known as a zoo. So, mother guardian at the issue as the day the prop prop comes at the Lanka Rawato. And now we have a flow, inshallah. So, stay with us. So, we've now hit the M25 orbital motorway which basically encircles London. And from here, you can go to central London, different parts of London, uh, Potter's Bar on the left-hand side, head off towards Cambridge and very various other directions as well. So some facts about the motorway. It's very busy. <laughs> Here's another simple fact. There's some crazy things that go on on the M25. And when the M25 comes to a stop, okay, it's absolutely chaotic. So simple, <laughs> simple facts about the motorway which encircles okay london i think built more or less from what i remember about a quarter of a century ago and i have been stuck on this motorway many times regular journeys to london in 2010 and 11 when i was learning neuro linguistic program and master practitioner of neuro linguistic program and becoming a trainer and i stayed in london in wimbledon in uh, Peckham, in 
uh, on the Edgware Road, in Edgware, Kensington and many other places as well. However, at the moment, the sun is out and it's roughly about 10 degrees. And as you can see, okay, traffic is flowing fairly nicely. And remember, if you like what you see, please subscribe, like and share with your family and friends. So right, the the podcast anti the not motorbike one here on doing seventy in excess of seventy miles per hour. And as we hit some of London's tourist places as well, Lee Valley Park and the Paradise Park as well. And the A ten is further ahead towards London Enfield and also Hartford Junction twenty five or Mungabur. Junction 27, Kuzi, inshallah. Now, the market came really good, the lady. So you should smile. Keep right to stay on M25. As we come into the Holmesdale Tunnel, 750 yards. So, Porta Mechedeno, Bella Road, the Sarkuna de Hafarawandi. First of all, the only lady, the jump jumper, and other, mashallah, yeah. So underground Ravanyu, a market to them over the Jarai that it starts to come. A raise as we go up the hill. And here comes the light. So a legit then harja the gikiri that's a ranara wali mashallah. Ah the gra bosh like a tidi the red sports car. The Bell Common Tunnel, 550 yards. There we go, mashallah. There's an 11 minute slowdown caused by a crash on the M11 in five miles. You are still on the fastest route. So the headlights are on of the vehicle and it's very nice and bright as well. As we go underground and then just come back to a normal situation with a truck right in front of us. We check our mirrors and give our signal. It's safe to steer into the right-hand lane. And we're flowing past the truck at 70 miles per hour. And I'll check my centre mirror and just slow mile, down a little bit. Junction 27, take so M25 Narakushlu, and this is the M11 now, Junction 27. Or Roro Jiden or Avanyu, Kabi side the Dol Jidenu, Badini, Baranche de Mashalla, or Smoka, or Pedavar Bohushale.
سماش اللہ اللہ مبارک لنا فیحا اللہ مبارک لنا فیحا اللہ مبارک لنا فیحا اللہ مرزقنا جناحا و حبیبنا اہلہا و حبیب صالحی اہلہا الینا So we have come into Ilford and one of the distinguishing marks of coming into any part of London are the red buses. So our whole destination that you know your Romula Liriu and we've basically been on the road for the best part of about five hours and we are now getting closer to our destination. So basically we are in a red bridge which is I think a part of uh, Ilford and as you can see the high-rise buildings are a great sight in any any city knowing that lots and lots of people are living in not congested areas but there's lots of people that are living in in busy areas and there's lots of uh, clean and high standard uh, accommodation there are possibly hundreds of languages that are spoken in international areas like these as well as we start to follow our direction on a four-laned road with a red bus on the left hand side use the right three lanes to turn slightly right onto chapel road a118 so we're going towards barking here we go, so we just go through the traffic light and it looks like we're in a busy part of the centre area. Lots of shops and lots of people on a Saturday afternoon. So we've come to a, a roundabout where it says Addison and Han Solicitors. So roundabout one in area one. Jam lagi dalam So as we come into, I think it's Ilford Lane here. Dukan ini dia ada gerjong dah. There's a church as well. Biryani by Ustaz Zafar Palawan. Oh, Palawan. Sebab jadi nama syarlah ager biryani jodoh. Crispy's chicken, ninety-nine pence. An Iman quality meats and a beauty and laser clinic. So, alta biryani khray, alta dorey khray, alta burger khray, or be a mazla alta ghi dukaan al nachi or makeup vagera chidan ukaiya. So, zan safas utrakai. Al mashallah, look at this. Looks like a busy precinct as well. And how wonderful! Two and a half percent of your earnings, okay, giving zakat for the sake of Allah. How beautiful is that? Allah is the creator owner and sustainer and giving two and a half percent of your monies will make your personal wealth protected allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will protect it and you will be able to support those that are in need throughout the world as well and as some scholars will say that when all muslims will give their zakat poverty will start to reduce and possibly disappear So we have a Stylo Plaza, Gorilla, lots of clothes on my left hand side, almost look like Gorilla, Gorilla. Uh, lots of mobile shops so people can still stay in touch and communicate with the loved ones and communicate with naughty people sometimes too. Mashallah looks like a well developed area, busy with traffic as we be nice, okay to the person who's shooting with his car at someone else, waving at the sky and saying thank you to me at the same time. And in the middle of it all, you have a learner, a driver. Well, it looks like a driving instructor. Which wasn't very nice. Swagata Jewelers on the left hand side. Oh, I got the Bradford invention. Okay, Kashmir Crown Bakeries into Regal Bakeries into the cake box. 
started by Uncle Salim, God bless his soul, many, many years ago. So I read Fordgate in Hanover Square and then Victoria Street. International Business Show. And Ilford Station, Lago de Basula, Rwande. Al-Tol Sur Basunachidi, these are all part of the London Transport. And we have an Uber Eats guy as well. So, Muntaraf Tala Kyaguri. Rangla Chidan, Sekal Nazama Halle Priyato. Ah, Vadilaro. And we have a very international looking population. Overseas Pakistanis, overseas Bangladeshis, overseas Africans, overseas Europeans, the indigenous population, and a beautiful fruit store as well on the left hand side, the Dubai Hindwani, Chidan Pratini. And here comes the L plated driver from the front as well. I the Yomasism Road Maki Road Kraskai, so Road Balaruku, the Hohogurina, Kideshi. Star Gubani Fariki, Kiresi, Ogunubani Fariki, Kiresi, Yerigi, which is Don't Know, so Roli Krasko. And now we're going to go to the open buzzing businesses on a Saturday afternoon. I'm not going to get a pedestrian crossing there, and I've just missed Windsor Road. So I'll take the next road on the left as well. Here comes a young man. A road by Kraske, I know, but it's a common road. We do both sides of the city, and issue. So we're just waiting here. Will the light turn to red, or will the light remain on green? Plastic stores, shoe stores, but it's just a no stress, lah. So the more kili kili chata patani, aval so ki pedal banda chirashi no des jar dabi bani buttoni button chit dabau ki. No traffic to Parabati Chidan or Srashi, no Ariakal safety, Sarah Hifazat Sarah Road Karaski. Oh, here's another driving instructor. It says Abbey's on the top, and it looks like E20BAS, possibly Ibas or Abbas. Yeah. With Junaid Jamshade shop on the left hand side. May God bless his soul, he's gone from Dunya. An actor turned Nasheed artist, artist and Religious preacher, I suppose, is what you would call him in English. And do I need to take the next road on the left, Jeanette? Carry on following the road ahead. We shall keep the side road clear for turning traffic. Now, here the Manjaros, or here the Kakacha, then the road Kraskai, but the Ani Oahali, which polite language came at Labde. Thank you, or Kanuni language came. In the law of the land, okay, it's a warning, so you should never take it to proceed. What else do we have? Halal butchers, Shell petrol station. <laughs> oh, a market road safari show. So we'll just keep going very gently. We'll just keep following the road ahead. What do we have on the right hand side? Al Ghani Trade Center. Established businesses on the left and right, and there's Islamabad halal butchers. Do I take the next road on the left or do I keep following the road ahead? Turn left. Oh, Turn left. The road start was a large or the road like a soap grass cane was about garden with a rookum, a saraki gurium now, a si pram sarala gada, and it says 20 miles an hour. And I've in just come off of Ilford mile, Lane. The roundabout, take the third exit onto Road. Oh my goodness. Oh. Oh, uh, in, internal streets. We've turned into the internal streets. And it looks like the houses are possibly Victorian. So, late right, 1850s plus. They look huge in size. And it's typical of some of the streets in these 
uh, type of areas and they're very congested and one truck was just coming through the road earlier on and no traffic could get through however it is what it is in the southern parts of England and at the roundabout follow the road ahead turn right okay in into 50 yards, Woodley Road at the roundabout take the second exit onto Eaton Road oh and as I enter under the road looks like it's busy here too and at the end of the road I'm going no it's a mini roundabout turn right or turn left turn a right and have a look on the right hand side here's Shane Hakari so I'll go across very steadily and let's keep on going Oxford Road is it oh into the garden I swear hope you've enjoyed what you've seen so so far part two is on its way listen to a message from my friends and please tune in to part two inshallah assalamu alaikum okay guys number one yeah. number two Line. number three Line. number four Line. and number five assalamu alaikum <laughs>